All right, hey guys, my name is Shadow, and welcome back to some more Elite Dangerous in the 2.3 The Commander's Update. You may notice that my Asp Explorer looks a little bit different today. That's because there is a brand new ship kit out right now that, well, it makes it look like this. It's called the Raider Ship Kit. There's one for the Asp Explorer, and there's also one for the Cobra Mark III. Now, I don't have the one for the Cobra Mark III yet, but I thought this would be something cool to take a look at just because it's so unique. Look at this. Now, there are a lot of options available for this thing, and one of the things that I like best about this is unlike the regular ship kit for the Asp Explorer, you actually get a tailpiece with this. Yeah. So, whereas with the regular ship kit, there were only three different pieces available to choose from, you actually get all four for this. And, not only do you get all of those options, but this set of stuff actually comes with six new skins for this thing, all for just the same price as the ship kit. I really sound like the Frontier Development's marketing team right now, but totally not. Anyways, I just like the ship kit. So, yeah, this is really cool. Now, we're going to take a look at all the different pieces that this comes with and stuff, but, yeah, let's just, let's just look at this for a moment. And, now that we have the new free camera system, which I'm using right here, we can totally, like, go and look at, like, each set of stuff just, like, up close like we didn't do last time and you guys all said we want, you wanted to do that. And, yeah, we can totally do that now. It was really annoying to do that with the debug camera, but it's not so annoying to do it with the free camera system. I love the way that this ship kit makes the Asp Explorer look like a Reaver ship from Firefly. That is so awesome. Okay, anyways, let's go take a look at all the different stuff that this comes with. All right, so here we are in outfitting. Now, as you can see, there is a big annoying thing right in front of the ship here, so that's stupid, and I apologize for that thing being there. We'll, we'll go do something better than having this thing block our, our path when we actually look at stuff. So, anyways, let's take a look at some paint jobs first. What do we get here? Well, we get six different paint jobs. We get Corroded 1, Corroded 2, Corroded 3, four, five, and six. Now they all look pretty similar to each other. It's just a little variation in color, but they all display like some kind of, you know, damage and stuff. You can kind of see it under this bulkhead thing here. Again, I apologize for that being there. I don't know who, whoever put that there should just be fired, really. That's that's not cool. Anyways, so yeah, it's, it's all pretty much the same. It's just slight variations in color. I can't say I'm a huge fan of any of these. I, I don't know if I'll be using any of those. Let's see how this looks with just a regular skin. So yeah, obviously you can use these ship kits with just your regular skins. So you can kind of see it here just, you know, hanging out under, the, again, under this big annoying thing. But yeah, so, so there's those. I'm not going to put a different one on here. I'll just leave whatever one I had on there. I guess it's corroded number six if anybody was wondering. But okay, let's actually go take a look at the different pieces of the ship kit, because I'm sure that's what all of you guys who are watching this video care about. So yeah, we actually get this. I think I think we didn't have the tail part before. Yeah, okay, because I don't have any tail pieces for my original ship kit. So cool. Yeah, it's a, this kit actually comes with 12 pieces for the third time saying that. It actually comes with 12 pieces, so that does make it like $12. But I mean, it's the whole ship kit, plus you get skins. How cool is that? Anyways, let's start with this part. So, I have my original ship kit in here, so just ignore those pieces. These last three right here, these are the new pieces. So, let's go with... Well, you know what we'll do? We'll do each combination of pieces together, and then we'll go and look at those on the free camera, and then we'll just do that, basically. Anyways, we'll go through all three of these. So, there's this and they don't actually call them anything different like in the original ship kit this is like spoiler one two three four but these are all just called the same thing for whatever reason so we can't differentiate so in the comments if you want to tell me you like explorer raider ship kit with explorer raider ship kit and then you want to combo explorer raider ship kit with that that's perfectly fine i won't know what you're talking about but yeah I mean, I like my Explorer Raider ship kit with the other Explorer Raider ship kit and then some more Explorer Raider ship kit on that with, you know, the Explorer Raider corrosive skin. So, yeah, like that. Anyways, so we have number one here, Explorer Raider ship kit. Number two, Explorer Raider ship kit. 
And number three, Explorer Raider Ship Kit. I think this is the one that I just had on when we were looking at it on the launch pad or on the landing pad. So let's go with, we'll just put on all the number ones here. I'm going to call those number ones, even though they're not called anything, but I'm going to call that number one. So yeah, anyways, let's go in here. And then for this, we have Explorer Raider Ship Kit. Then we have Explorer Raider Ship Kit. And we have Explorer Raider Ship Kit. Yes, so let's go with Explorer Raider Ship Kit. Then for the tail, let's take a look in the tail. We have Explorer Raider Ship Kit. That one's actually fairly cool looking. Then we have Explorer Raider Ship Kit. That's that's more cool looking, I think, actually. It kind of like encompasses the engines a little bit there. Yeah, okay. We'll take a look at that when we do the middle Explorer Raider Ship Kit. And then we have Explorer Raider Ship Kit. I also like this one. This is pretty cool. But let's put on number one right now. I guess that's number one. We'll call that number one. Okay, number one. Good. All right. Then for the front, I believe I have the Explorer Raider Ship Kit on when we were just looking at it on the landing pad. But we also have Explorer Raider Ship Kit. And we have Explorer Raider Ship Kit. So let's put back on Explorer Raider Ship Kit. And then we'll go to the free camera and take a look at our Explorer Raider Ship Kit. Okay, so the first combination of Explorer Raider Ship Kit is pretty much mostly what I had on when we were up on the landing pad just a minute ago. I don't think I had this back part on on the tail here, but yeah, other than that, that's pretty much what we had. So that's, that's pretty cool looking. I'd probably fly the ship around like this if I were going to fly the ship around with the Explorer Raider Ship Kit on so yeah okay then let's go back and put on the the next combination of stuff like the middle one or number two what i'm going to call explorer raider ship kit number two and here is explorer raider ship kit option number two this is also pretty cool looking i think this looks a bit more reaver like i also like these tail parts a little bit better around the engines right here these are these are really cool i like these yeah those are those are awesome so even if I used different ship kit pieces, I'd probably use those like tail pieces. Those are awesome. Yeah, this definitely looks very, very Reaver. Very, very Firefly Reaver. Yeah, quite. And we can't really get up much higher than that because, you know, the, the docking bay and stuff. But yeah, that's, that's very cool looking. So let's take a look at Explorer Raider ship kit option number three. And here is Explorer Raider Ship Kit option number three. Now this also looks very Reaver-like. However, it's just very spiky. And I don't feel like Reavers have like this many spikes on their ship, are on their ships. It's cool, I like it, but I like the first two options better. But I mean, you can mix and match, obviously. So whatever, whatever you guys like is, is what you should use. Uh, I think I like this option the least, though. I mean, while I am a fan of spiky things, like, this is too many spikes for me. Like, it's it's okay. It's okay. I mean, it looks all right. Like, if the other two options didn't exist, I wouldn't, I wouldn't not use this, you know. But since the other two options do exist, I would sooner go with one of the first two. But, yeah, it's not bad. It just looks like kind of a space porcupine or something like that yeah i don't know i wouldn't want to i wouldn't want to have a pet one of these and then just be like who's a good ass to explore oh you bur oh, burn me no stab me stab me stab me yeah yeah sharp things stab you not burn you right anyways yeah that's that's pretty much the ship kit now there is one other thing i want to talk about and let's take a look at that now you may notice that we're back in the Hollow Me section. Now this is my Hollow Me character. He's just, you know, a guy. And unfortunately there still isn't a way to like edit your body. I'm not really a fan of the default body really, but there are some new like jumpsuit type things or flight suits or whatever they're called. And since there are raider skins and we were just talking or raider ship kits and we were just talking about that i thought we'd mention that there are also raider flight suits available now i only have this one so i'm not going to open up the thing and show you guys all of them because i don't have the rest of them i just bought this one but these you have to purchase individually for some reason and they're like three dollars a piece so i just bought the one because i really only like this one i wasn't going to use 
you know, five more of them and pay more of them and then I'm not going to use them. That's stupid. So whatever. But this one I thought looked pretty cool. You know, I mean, even though you can't change the shape of the body, I figured, hey, this is way better looking than the regular stupid flight suit that I don't like. So yeah. Okay. Anyways, that's, that's pretty much it. Yeah. So <laughs> that has been a look at the Asp Explorer Raider ship kit and also this jumpsuit. I keep saying jumpsuit, but I think it's called a flight suit. Whatever it's called, it's that. It's the thing that my guy is wearing. So anyways, that's pretty much it for this video, guys. Let me know what you thought down in the comments. Like it if you like it. Dislike it. Whatever. You know the drill by now. You've seen enough of my videos. You know what I'm going to say at the end. That's it for me, guys. Thank you for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video.